Okay. King's Quest 3. Subtitle To Hair is Human. The puns never stop. Oh, Roberta Williams. It's always something with you. And some right. creepy music in the background here. Right, so, you're this guy named Guidion, who's almost 18. He lives on the top of a mountain with an evil wizard named Mnanon. Mnanon? Mnanon. Oh. That's, that's his name. Which has way too many A's and N's for only a eight-letter name. Thank you for that. Gideon is a lonely lad of 17 who has lived for as long as he can remember with an evil and cruel wizard by the name of Manan. Manan. Gideon gazes upon the countryside of Ludor, wishing he was free to leave something something. Alright, alright, pause the game. Manan treats the poor boy like his slave, ordering him about, constantly threatening him and refusing to ever let him leave the premises. Often Gideon wonders who he really is, and how he came to live with the old wizard. And I have to say this really fast, apparently. Yes. Suddenly the front door opens and out stalks Manan, the wizard. Manan. <laughs> he shouts harshly. Manan, <laughs> Oh, oh, Gideon rushes to his side, afraid he may be in trouble. Why are you not working, boy? The wizard sneers. Gideon mumbles a faint reply. The kitchen floor is filthy, Manan grumbles. Go sweep it now! Turning on his heel, the wizard re-enters the house, slamming the door behind him. And I went so fast that... Uh, slamming the door behind him, Mananan. Have you forgotten? <laughs> Mananan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Obvious mm. joke out of the way. Pause the game immediately! Such is the story of a young Gideon's life to this point. What a poor boy to do. Oh well, in resignation, Gideon obediently follows Manan into the house. Hopefully that means the game will start now and when I can pause. Oh, that was the intro. Da, 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 da. Okay, let's just get straight into this. Okay, I paused the game. Right, so as I was reading... Mananan uh, Guidion. So, Guidion is treated like a slave and forced to work a lot, and he is never allowed to leave the mountain and explore the rest of the land of Ludor. Uh, Mananan also has a black cat, which is usually harmless, but will occasionally try to trip Guidion and kill him. So, you know, harmless. That's the very definition of Armus. Don't worry too much, this only ever happens in one screen. Every so often, Mnanan checks up on Guidion and kills him if there is any evidence that he did anything suspicious. At these times, he either demands food or makes Guidion do a chore. It repeats Guidion way too many times. <laughs> if, if Guidion doesn't do his duties, Mnanan gives him really weird punishments, like turning him into a snail. It has a lot of differences from most King's Quest games in that you are so limited at the start of the game, and you have to obey Mnanan's rules. But first you need to find out what his rules are, and which ones are really serious. Eesh. Yes, yes, uh, you don't want to do this. Well, too bad! <laughs> <laughs> It's not like the rest of the series where you can uh, mostly just wander around and do stuff without pressure. Also, it involves a lot of waiting, which can be boring. You may consider bringing something to read, or fold the laundry or something. <laughs> Look, well, we got the walkthrough well, then. Well, walkthrough. <laughs> Aren't you clever? <laughs> Aren't you clever? Who wrote this? <laughs> Don't worry about missing an event that occurs at a specific time, as the game pauses whenever anything important happens. Right, so, that was an excerpt from one of the two walkthroughs I've gotten for this game, because you can never be too sure about things. <laughs> oh yes, you can never be too sure. 
And also, so, Bad Hog's well prepared. Yes, I am well prepared. The bar is not. So, what's the deal with King's Quest 3 in a nutshell? Aside from what we established so far. Spoiler alert, Gwydion is really Alexander, Sir Graham's firstborn son, whom is now a king, by the way, Sir Graham, that is. He's King Graham. He married Valenys uh, at the end of King's Quest 2. We had our feel with Graham already, <laughs> <laughs> if I say so myself. So now we're playing his kidnapped son, who's being raised as a slave by Menernan. Never get tired of saying his name. Completely ridiculous. Can we agree Sierra is not the best when it comes to naming conventions? Oh, yeah, I think we can, yes. So anyway, Menanen uh, has you as a slave. And the game is in a constant timer, so to speak. Gwydion will become 18 years old. And when the time comes, Menanen will give him his birthday present. Which is death. And we don't want that. Well, it's a peculiar birthday present, I admit. But you know what they say. It's the thought that counts. <laughs> He's giving you death. For some reason. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't understand the motivations of this guy. Maybe he just did all this to spite on Graham. But whatever. Anyway, he's going to kill him when he gets 18. So... The first half of this game is going to be basically us in a race against time to get rid of Menanen before he gets rid of us. And it's going to be tricky because the guy is always watching you. Well, except when he's not. But otherwise he's always watching you. Yeah. Right, so let's get started. Let's see, uh, you're standing inside the house, and Menanen should appear in several moments to tell you to do some kind of chore. So, let's wait. Alright, okay, about to save the game, I don't want this, in file, yes. Okay, so, let's wait here, patiently, and there's a timer at the top, uh, already I see. Yep, I told you. Dun, 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 <sighs> dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, I've already told Mad Hog this, but did I ever tell you folks I hate these sort of games that have timers on? What, what, you cannot handle the pressure? <laughs> There's that black cat there. Oh yes, it's that black cat. You know, the one that's mostly harmless, except when he kills you. Yes. You know? <laughs> yes, because he's black cat -o. Um. Sorry. He's also, he's also a very big cat. I mean, the sprite is the sprite is pretty huge. The compilation of pixels that form that cat is rather huge compared to uh, Gwydion here. I really like his walking cycle. Yeah, it's he's, like he's walking it, like he doesn't give a damn. He's like one of those musical characters. Like. You know, if he could walk in reverse, he would be doing the Moonwalker. Where are you going? I Manan wasn't coming. No, you have to wait for him. Are you sure? Because it's been... It's, it's, it's what the walkthrough says. It's been like 1 minute 23 by this game's timer. If it doesn't give you orders, you're not supposed to do anything. I wonder what, how I stop walking there because I just press the key and then he just walks, walks, walks. Oh, he stopped now. Hey. Mm. Okay, how about we look around? This is the main entry room of the wizard's house. The front door is to the south, creaky stairs go upstairs, and doorways lead north and east. Oh, creaky stairs. Stairs. We probably don't want to, to uh, uh, go up there unless we know he's going to be away. Probably. You know, you might as well explore at this point. Yeah. Okay. Like, let's go into this room, see. Uh, so it just seems like a desk room. Oh, this is one of these awkward stairs. Oh, no! Oh, the stairs in the King's Quest games are the worst! It's just as it appears. Hey, it's a picture of George Muir! Wait a minute. Wait, wait, Davar, who is George Muir? 
You... Who's Judge Muir? <laughs> 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 It seems like the picture of John Muir from this distance. It does, actually, because it has the red frame, the grayscale photo. Wow, those stairs. This is very awkward, this, these stairs. Well, imagine if you're playing uh, King's Quest IV when you have to climb stairs that don't even have a bunny stair. Whoa! Oh, there he is. Hi, my man. We were looking for you. Gideon, you are assigned a chore. You know what happens to lazy boys. Manan shakes his head in disgust. The kitchen is still dirty. When will you learn to obey? Up goes the dreaded finger. Wait, when did you... When did you tell us to do things? Oh. You need to work off a little of that weight, Gideon. Snarls Manan. He didn't tell us anything. Boy, do you hate these little sessions, but... No pain, no magic. What just? What? What's it ha What's happening to us? What? 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 The... Uh, I see you're working out. For all eternity. Uh. Oh, I get it now. He's doing star jumps. I thought he was having a seizure. So okay, so this is what the walkthrough means by weird punishments. Uh, yes, yeah, well, um, he's... I think he's going to train up until he dies of fatigue. That's, um... This is a that's... very overlong, overstated death that's... sequence. Okay, so... Uh, the walkthrough told us we should wait for the guy to tell us what the chores are. But apparently we did not need to do that. We had to do the chores immediately. Whew! Okay, so we didn't die, um, luckily. Okay, no, okay, so load the game. Load the game, just yeah. to be sure. Oh. Restore. He didn't ask us for anything, did he? Yeah, you know, outside the house. I, I don't think he did, but uh, let's do the stuff anyway. I had the stuff written on here. Unless we had to just stand there like Dufus is waiting for him. You open the front door to the house and go outside. Okay, Thank so you. Thank you for that game. I wouldn't have been able to guess. So anyway, uh, stand behind the pen near the bag. Take some chicken feed from the bag. Enter the pen and feed them. Alright, let me just get it. Okay, so... Open bag. By the way, you have three in-game minutes to do all the chores. So that's what the timer is for. The bag behind the fence is full of chicken feed. Right, Get so it. Chicken feed. You only need the chicken feed if you want to feed the chickens. Uh, that's, that's why I, I want you to take it. That's. Okay, take chicken feed. You're not making sense, game. Uh, take the bag, I guess. Take bag. Okay, check the inventory. Maybe you already have it. You have nothing. Oh, what? Okay. Okay, get. Get. Chicken feed. I bet that's the problem. You only need the chicken feed. What the freaking... Pick up? What is wrong with you? <laughs> um... But this game... We, we're not off on a good start. Oh, you just need to just throw it. Oh, screw you. Ugh. I'm just tempted to re reload just because that was waste yeah. of time. Yeah, let's do that. By the way, folks, great game so far. Great. <laughs> Very entertaining, too. I think this walkthrough might have something wrong here. Because it says you have to enter the pen to feed the chicken, but apparently you don't need to. Right, so do whatever it is that throw, you had to do. Throw chicken feed. Lovely la, eat the chicken feed so that you may get fattened up and we will have chicken breasts for dinner. <laughs> We're going to sell you to Colonel Kentucky. 
Not to uh, Colonel Sanders. What am I saying? Uh, no, Colonel, Colonel Sanders. The Colonel is called Sanders. Uh, it's the the chicken is called Kentucky Fried, and my Colonel mistake. Kentucky. <laughs> Colonel Kentucky Fried Sanders. What? So so Sanders actually had uh, okay open door. I'm gonna okay. s I'm gonna save now just because we did that. All right. So next stop is the kitchen. Screw you, chicken. <laughs> Alright, the chicken is behind the dining room. Take the broom and clean the kitchen. Okay, in the dining room. It's beyond, yes, the dining room, which is that one. So, yes. So, where about to the... You can, you, can you actually walk faster? Uh, because uh, there should be the option to... This is where Manan eats his meal. Manan. You have called... Manan. Manan. Yes, you keep forgetting a, uh, a syllable. <laughs> <laughs> I keep reading it as Mananen. Dr. Mananen. <laughs> so this is where Dr. Mananen lives. Also known as Colonel Kentucky Fried Sanders. <laughs> they're all the same person. <laughs> you, of course, are not surprised to eat here. You eat in the kitchen. There is a pine table and benches large enough to seat at least ten people, but the wizard has never had any guests for dinner. Great. Okay, so... Uh, oh yeah, you asked if whether we can increase the speed of this game. It should be, uh, fast. There we go. Yeah, much better. Okay, so... Also, we waste less time. Okay, the, you said, what, what are you doing? You said there's a broom somewhere, right? In the ah, kitchen. Should be here. Yeah, uh, I think, uh, yes, it's the one beside the... Take am broom. The, the Amish device for making the rice. Right. Right, perfect. So what we do right. now after this? After that, just north of where you are standing is Mananan's office. There is a little duster on top of the cabinet in the southwest corner of the room. Take the duster and clean the room. I clearly have to go back in the main hall and then go north from there. Yeah. I gathered that much. Time is of the essence! We must go! We will save the kingdom by cleaning Mananan's dusty place! And then we had to clean up his um, bed toilet, Take if you know what I'm cloth. saying. What's a cloth? I don't know, what's a paladin? Mananan's is very pri private with his study and doesn't like you poking around. The huge oak desk is covered with his writing implements, an oak cabinet is in the corner. There is a duster atop the cabinet. Ah, so there is a chart on the rear wall, the bookshelves are filled with books, and every subject the wizard fancies himself to be quite the scholar. Okay, Whatever. so take duster? You are not close enough. Where did you say it was again? Atop the cabinet. There we go. Yes. Please don't step on the cat. Hmm. I don't. I don't want to see a feline death in this game. All right. Upstairs in Mananan's bedroom, beside the bed, is the chamber pot. Take it and dump it out the window. Yuck. Ugh. That's what. That's what literally is written here. Yuck. Well, I'm, well, everyone's gonna have their yucks with this. Yuck! 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 yuck. <laughs> oh, those stairs. Those beautiful, beautiful stairs. Imagine actually trying to do this in real life. You know, basically, you're going to have to go to the side of the stair and then walk. Oh, you know, just... Imagine having to do this without banisters in King's Quest IV when you die by climbing stairs, which is ridiculous. Screw you! Stairs! Okay, so whereabouts is his bedroom? Right, so, I'm gonna guess uh, it. Yes, Mananan's. What? Uh oh. What are you doing, Mananan? He's punishing us for being late, I guess. Um, never mind. J he was just checking on you. Just checking. Just okay. checking. This is his bed! Really? This is where he sleeps. <laughs> Seriously, he has a beauty mirror, a beauty mirror, <laughs> he has a pink bed. Mananan, is there something you want to tell us? 
It's okay, man. It's okay. I, I can understand why you're so angry. We are all here for you. So, whatever you want to say to us, remember, we are your friends. Yeah. We are here for you. Yeah, we're always there for you. You don't need to kidnap children when they are, you know, just born and enslave them and kill them when they get 18. Just because you're angry at the world. It ain't healthy, man. It ain't healthy. Yeah, think about your blood pressure and the stress. Also, if you want to be say you're fabulous every so often, then you can go out and say it. It is so. It is okay to feel fabulous. Yes, just accept the fabulousness. <laughs> okay, but seriously, this. Okay, so we're supposed to fear this guy because he's going to kill us, and yet you go to his freaking room and it's Barbie's dream house. Basically. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with that? Living in the Cre dream house. <laughs> Credibility? <laughs> What's that? Wrinkling your nose in disgust, you throw the smelly contents of the chamber pot out the open window and over the cat. What a way to make a living. Fantastic. There are four food items in the kitchen, plus one more elsewhere, that you can take to feed Mananan when he gets angry. I think the next order of business is going to the kitchen and retrieve those items. Yes, let's do that. No, that freaked me out a bit, him just standing there. Just... He tends to do that every once in a while, completely at random. Just to be all like, I am making sure you're not doing anything weird. Alright, so after doing your chore, take the cup in the dining room. Okay, take the cup in the dining room. Which is over there, obviously. Don't get stuck on the table, Gideon. Uh, his, his, his name is Gwydion, not Gideon. Gwydion, I have decided to take a journey. Oh! Save the game, now! Okay. Okay, we need to be super fast. We have about 25 minutes before he returns. Gotta go fast! Right, so where... Gotta go fast! So, okay, All so right, so... quickly tell me what we need to do. Okay, get the cap. Take cup. You pick up the little tin cup and carry it with you. Yes, go in the kitchen. Take all the food on the table. The knife and the spoon from the rack. Okay. Take food. You take the loaf of bread and carry it with you. You take the fruit and carry it with you. You take the mutton chop and carry it with you. The mutton chop? Okay, and okay. you said there was a knife? Alright, so there is a knife and spoon from the rack. Yeah, I see them. Take knife. Take knife. What a tail! What the? F what? I t I'm pretty sure I said take. You take the carving knife from the iron rack and keep it with you. Take. You misspelled take. Yes, I did. You take spoon. the wooden spoon from the iron yes. rack and keep it with you. Yes, we have the spoon. Okay. Right. So now. Ah. And the bowl from the shelf. Okay, so, uh, take bowl. Oh, I guess it's over here somewhere. That's. What's a tail? I meant take. It's spelled again. Where is the bowl? Uh, it says that the bowl is, uh, uh, is in the shelf. You retrieve the clay bowl from the kitchen shelf and take it with you. Right. Uh, pause the game. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here's what the walkthrough says. You can walk around a look. Uh, I see a little bit of a grammatical mistake here. But anyway, you can walk around and look at the various rooms in the house. However, do not try to take anything else yet or go down the mountain. Yes, he'll be going down the mountain. He'll be going. <laughs> Later on, most likely any other item you find in the house will be starred with an asterisk item. Yeah. If Mnanan appears and you have a starred item, or more than one, in your inventory or have descended too far down the mountain, zap. It literally says zap. Ah, uh, I guess that means death. Or something even worse, like a training session. Ugh. <laughs> 
After about five to seven game minutes, Mnanen should appear and tell you that he is going to embark upon a journey. Take note of the time when he says this. You have 25 minutes before he returns. After he disappears, go to his bedroom, open the drawer underneath the mirror vanity. It is a vanity mirror! It's a freaking vanity mirror! To get a hand mirror for minutes. That means by the time it gets to 30 minutes... Yes. We'll be in the hot water by then. Okay, so he only goes on a journey two times in this uh, game. And if we do not progress in what we need to progress, the game becomes unbeatable, obviously. Oh, gosh. Alright, let's head into his room. Alright, so vanity mirror. Open the freaking... Uh, Open drawer. Is that... Mananan has issues. Quietly opening the drawer below the closet, you discover nothing that interests you. Okay, so I'm, he must meant the other drawer here. You bang the drawer against your shins repeatedly. Try backing up. Oh, I guess it means... Wow. This is really finicky. You find baubles and trinkets which does not interest you. Suddenly your eyes fall on something that does. A vile label rose petal essence, which you eagerly take. What does rose petal essence do anyway? I would not know. Maybe it's just a cologne. Oh boy. Oh, maybe I know. He's a closet transvestite. Ah, oh, you mean everything we've been implying so far about him? Yes. Genius, Devar. <laughs> I know. Yes. It, it just came to me. Yeah. I wonder why. <laughs> so anyway, now that you have the uh, rose petal essence, look on top of the closet to find a bray uh, a, a, a brass key. All right. Take it. Take it. Just take it. It's a, it's of no use. Oh wait, it's because you have to look at you. You have to look at it. The closet is fashioned of only carved mahogany. Mahogany. Oh, no, 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 no. You are hand along the top of the closet. Suddenly, you touch something metallic. Grabbing it, you discover a small brass key. What could it unlock? Unlock the closet. Oh, okay. Okay, so we are about to get Mananan out of the closet. <laughs> How can you use that which you do not have? What oh. are you talking about? I thought you'd say it. Oh. Let me check the inventory. Do we have it? Yes, we have the brass key on us. Okay, I, I know. Open closet with brass key. Because this game is picky, isn't it? How can you do that? I, I don't know. How can you breathe? What is wrong with you? So I just have to open the closet normally. Oh, sod off. All right, so uh, there's a nice dark attire there. You see? Uh, very cheerful. You it see? says on the walkthrough. You see voluminous velvet voluminous, robes. Voluminous velvet robes. Satin, satin slippers. slippers Pig hats, hats. And, and soft, soft linen, linen gowns. gowns. Well, I wanted to read this one. Well, it doesn't sound that bad. Look behind the clothes to see a magic map. Take it! Just take it! You are startled to discover an ancient parchment scroll. Its ink has faded, but it seems to be a map. Taking this treasure, you leave everything else exactly as it was. Okay. Right, so, what's the game? Do you have everything? Uh, let's see. Uh, we have a rose essence, a brass key, spoon, mirror, fruit, magic map, mutton, bread, empty cup, bowl, and a knife. Incidentally... Uh, those items have the asterisks. Yes, the brass yeah. key, the rose essence, and the magic map. Yes, hopefully he won't catch us red-handed, so to speak. Yeah. So anyway, the magic map will be discussed a bit later. Go upstairs to the telescope room. Upstairs to the telescope room? Look in the telescope if you like. Ludor seems to be a, such a nice place. Take the fly wings off the floor and go back downstairs. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go upstairs first, and then you have to remind me all that. Oh gosh, the cat. Please do not kill us. 
it might actually trip you. Oh gosh, the stairs! Ah, oh, not the stairs! Oh, oh the stairs! Ah, oh, who, who designed these stairs? Who is the maniacal monster? Right, what's to do here? Okay, look through the telescope. Okay, so look through. Look tele in the telescope. Look in telescope. There you go. You put your eye to the glass. It amazes you how near everything seems. You can even see squirrels climbing faraway trees. No wonder the wizard knows all activities in Ludor. Ludor. <laughs> it sounds very lewd, this whole place, doesn't it? I just like to say Ludor. Lude. It's just a funny... Just a funny name. Yes, it's a doorway to Ludor. <laughs> right. All right. So. So what next? Okay. Uh, uh, ah, there it is. Take the fly wings off the floor and go back downstairs. You were, ah, I see. I think they are over there. Yes, I see it. It's just the, the, right. No, stop. Go back. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. walking, Gwydion. Gwydion. Jesus. Oh, come on. Oh. He's right there. Ugh. This is ridiculous! Restore. Restore. <sighs> right. We got this it. Is... At this point, I got everything. And. Oh, good, the cat's not here. This is unbearable. I... Uh, come on, Ron Gilbert. Be quick inventing the scam system. This is. This is torture. I'm gonna s save here just because. Okay, I don't think you actually need to look through the freaking, yeah, freaking telescope. You pick up the dead fly and drop it into your hand. Disgustedly, you look at it. I don't want to carry around a dead fly. You think picking off its wings, you throw the rest away. Wow, that's morbid, even for a fly. <laughs> yeah. Okay, look through the telescope since you're there. Okay. It might actually be important. I don't know. I'm just doing what the walkthrough is telling me to do. You put your eye to it, blah blah. Okay. Right. Pause the game. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Go back downstairs. Find Mananan's black cat. Grab the cat. Grab the cat? This may take several tries before you can get a, a firm grip on it. Oh once no. It, yes, once it is in your arms, take some cat hair. Go outside and grab a chicken. Okay, for now let's just focus on getting that bloody cat. Somewhere. He that, must be somewhere. I know, but where could he have gotten to? Also, save the game once you finish climbing down the stairs, which seems like the most impossible feat. Oh, 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 oh. Grab, save the game, save the... the, the grab, grab cat. Game, we do not want this now. Nimble, yes. you grab the nasty cat by the scruff of its neck, avoiding its needle-sharp claws. Now that you have it, what are you going to do with it? It says take uh, cat hair, I think. Screech! Hee 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 hee. You manage to pluck some fur before the he viciously scratches and leaps from your arms. Ouchie. Mm. Okay, imagine if he died because of tetanus. Uh, yes. <laughs> because of the cat scratch. I mean, <laughs> sure, why not? Leisure Suit Larry dies for a viral disease once he had unprotected sex with a prostitute in Leisure Suit Larry 1, so he might as well. <laughs> Satisfaction. You scurry, you survey for your wound. Stupid cat. You scoff. Whether you know it or not, you just helped me. In some ridiculously convoluted way, the, I might add. The detestable cat leaps from your arms, snarling and screeching. Right. Right. So, 
Uh, we have the cat hair. Yes, yeah, so now we have to go grab a chicken, you say? Yes, let us grab a chicken. This is suddenly Legend of Zelda for some reason. Du, 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 du. <laughs> Sorry, I just love that link to the past. Uh, everybody loves that theme. Okay, now you have to uh, take a feather from Open a chicken. gate. Uh, grab chicken. Take, take feather. You have to catch a chicken. Catch chicken. 